I present to you Luann Loud's April Fool's Highlight Reel. I'd say this prank's a little over your head. <laughs> Seems to be your lucky day. <laughs> I guess that's a wrap. <laughs> Aw, look at the Loud family getting jiggly with it. <laughs> I shaved the best for last! <laughs> See what I mean? Nobody's safe from that evil pranking genius. But this year is gonna be different. Luann is not gonna prank me. Because I've got an April foolproof plan. Clyde, you wanna hang out tomorrow? I built us a fortress with snacks, games, and a tinkle tube. Patent pending. On pranks giving? No way. Not after what happened last year. <laughs> but nothing's gonna happen this year. I got an April foolproof plan. Hang on, Clyde. Ronnie Ann just texted me. She says she's coming over tomorrow with a present for me. <gasps> She can't come over tomorrow. She'll get nailed by Luann's pranks and then pulverize me. Oh no, Ronnie Ann's on her way. Could this day get any worse? Well, that's my answer. But on the plus side, that's one less prank Ronnie Ann could suffer. <gasps> that's it. If I set off all the pranks in the house, there won't be any left for her. Lincoln, it's not safe out there. Save yourselves. I got a job to do. Don't worry, Lincoln. I'll plan your funeral. Well, here goes nothing. I made that dish from scratch. <laughs> Lisa Marie Loud, let us in! I'll need some assurances in return. One, I will never again be punished for the explosions in or around the house. Happy April Stools! Are those diapers? She wouldn't. What, everyone? Just let us in! Sign here, here, and initial here. We ration the food, we should be okay. What does ration mean? <laughs> Typical! Now someone has to go into the kitchen for more supplies! I oh, yeah, 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 got it. It. <gasps> Let's draw straws! <sighs> I'll just go. I know I'm gonna lose. I'm a terrible artist. Actually, that's not what- Good luck, Lenny! <laughs> kitchen this way? Oh, thank you, sign. Thank you, sign. Thank you, sign. Thank you, sign. Okay, living room. So far, so good. I think this is how you kiss a girl. Don't hold back, Lincoln. Girls like a guy with passion. I can't let Ronnie Ann see this. I think ah, this stop, is how you stop. kiss a girl. Oh. Oh. Looks like spring is in the air. <laughs> Just gotta finish the bedrooms. <laughs> I won! You thought you'd outsmart me, but you got the worst pranking ever! You didn't really win, Luann. I only set off the pranks because Ronnie Ann was coming over. Yeah? Well, who do you think invited her over, genius? I knew I had to lure you out of your room, so I called Ronnie Ann and told her how much you love April Fool's Day. And here she is to deliver the final blow. Huh? Why'd you do that? You took all those pranks for me. It's the least I could do. Come on, let's draw some eyebrows on you and go get a milkshake. That girl's a keeper. Oh, hit the deck, it's a cologne blast! <laughs> <laughs> we got you! 
<laughs> what just happened? The boys love to pull pranks when I am in charge. They think they are so funny. We, we know, know we are. are. <laughs> Carlota, how would you like to get a little revenge? Not to brag, but back in Royal Woods, I was a pretty legendary pranker. Mm. Let me think about this for a sec. I'm in. First, we need to gather supplies. We're looking for anything that smells bad, is super sticky, or is just a pain to clean up. Oh, what about this bowl of warm tuna salad? Oh, man, that hits all three. Hmm, hair gel. So, the boys will enter, walk into this plastic wrap covered in hair gel. Then this bucket of breadcrumbs will dump on their heads when we pull the string. Dang, girl, you are a pranking genius. <laughs> <laughs> hey, have you guys seen my sticker gun? Bobby, it's clipped to your belt. Oh, sweet, thanks. Just gonna go grab some juice before I head back to the mercado. Wait, don't go in there. We set up a prank for Carl, CJ, and Carlitos. Uh-oh, feel sorry for them. I've been nailed by more of Ronnie Ann's pranks than I can count. I still can't grow hair here. Remind me not to cross you. Don't worry, I'm sure they'll be here any second. Can we stand? We have been squatting for an hour and I did not wear the right shoes for this. Ugh. Wait, what? Our, our prank, it's gone. They must have snuck in here and taken it down. I still can't figure out how they... Uh-oh. Prank and used it on us! Brad Ah! Ow! Ew! Ugh. We can't just let them get away with this. This is a prank war now. We've got to hit them with everything we've got. You're right. No one does this to my hair and gets away with it. Oh, boy! Can you come over here for a minute? Oh, they're gonna get it. <laughs> what happened to all of our balloons? <laughs> Dinner! Wash your hands, please. Shh. <laughs> Maybe it's time we stop pranking. Yeah, you're probably right. I just don't understand how they're figuring all my pranks out. Hello? Oh, hi, Maybelle. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I don't know why the mercado is closed early. No, I, yes, I understand. You need limes. Maybelle, I'll deliver the limes to you later, I promise. Right now we've got to run. Goodbye. I know how they're beating us, Bobby. After he heard we were going to prank the boys, he must have closed the mercado early and started helping them. That dirty double-crosser! This must be Bobby's payback for all the years I pranked his butt off. Now that we know the boys is a little secret, we've got the upper hand. Let's prank them till they beg for mercy. <laughs> Remind me to never cross you. To payback. Hear, hear. <sighs> I hate to admit it, Bobby, but I may have misjudged you. Tonight, you have proven yourself not completely useless. Oh, thanks, Carl. That means a lot. It's Ronnie Ann. Oh, she's headed to the mercado. I better get down there. She thinks I'm still at work. Water, though? Is that all you got? Dad's pickle juice. Pickle juice? Is that all you got? Actually, no. Carlota, release the catnip. Here, kitty, kitty, kitty. Everybody stay calm. We'll just go to the manager and get a new room. How do we know that's not exactly what Luann wants us to do? I vote we stay put. Hang on, Lisa. We'll get you out. Negative. Proceed without me. I'm safer in here. Let's go. Lincoln! The cricket! Ah, she cut the floorboards.
I'd rather be stuck up here than get pranked by Luann! Good evening, sir. We need a new room. Fine. You can have 1A. Princess is first! <laughs> Rat skunked me. The real 1A is over there! Don't touch that handle! Remember what happened to Lenny? Hi, you guys! I have an idea! And of course she made it rhubarb pie, which I'm allergic to. I can't take this anymore. I'm getting out of here. <sighs> My eyebrows! Quick, to the basement! It's always the safest place in an emergency! <laughs> Lily, no, it could be a trap. Oh, shoot. Say goodbye to your mother! Please tell me this is not bleach. And it's bleach. Go on without me. I don't want to be seen in public like this. Okay, take a knee. Now I know we're dropping like flies here, but let's not lose hope. If we stick together, we should be okay. Lynn Jr., why don't you grab the little sir and we'll find a safer spot to hide. Looks like it's just you and me, son. What do you say we go hide in the boiler room? Uh, wait, uh, okay, the, the roof is next. The roof is next? What does that mean? And why did you just look at your arm? What? And, and, uh, 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 uh. Room 2C? Hallway lobby? Room 1A? Laundry room? These are all the places we got pranked! <gasps> You've been helping her! Yeah, okay, I admit it. How could you sell out your own family like that? Luann promised me a prank-free decade. A decade, son! I hope it was worth it. Oh, it was not worth it. I feel terrible. What kind of father am I? What kind of... <laughs> husband? <laughs> it's okay, Dad. You're not the bad guy here. Luann is. No, no, son. I'm just as guilty. I went along with her. But maybe... It's not too late to redeem myself. What do you think of putting Operation Find Our Family and Get Back at Luann for causing years of emotional damage and also think of a shorter name for this operation into action? I'm in. My pranking is about to reach new heights. <laughs> Get it? Oh, there's no one here. Manager, this is Lynn Loud Sr. My son and I were just headed up to the roof, but we seem to have gotten stuck in the elevator. Uh, I'll be right there. This is what I get for hiring an amateur. That should do it. I have a bunch of awesome prank ideas. I have much to learn. Let's do this. Link is going to freak out over this dinosaur invasion. Okay, I brought my new and improved breakfast spot to... Oh! I knew this day would come. Take this, prehistoric scum. Huh? Sid, stop. It's just me. My bad. Breakfast spot is embarrassed. Goodbye. Eh, minus one point. I'm so sorry, Ronnie Ann. Let me help clean up. Oh, five point penalty for pranking the raft. Just stop. Don't move. Got it. I'll just sit in this chair and not move a muscle. I guess it's so. Oh no, Abuela! What was that noise? No. Okay. Oh. No more. 
pranks in my house. Fuera! Sorry, Ronnie Ann. I promise I'm gonna nail the next prank. I have a better idea. Maybe you can sneak into the Mercado, spy on Lincoln, and find out what kind of pranks he's planning. But be careful. Ooh! Reconnaissance. On it. Sid, those pranks were for Ronnie Ann. Sorry. Ow. Minus ten points for Lincoln. I called this truce to say we're not sure this prank thing is working out. Nice try, Ronnie Ann. Pranking me into thinking it's over. Psh, I see you. Uh, Sid, I'm serious. You have some great ideas, but you can't expect to be prank master in a day. It takes time, and you're kind of, sort of... Prank wrecking the prank anniversary. Sergio! No, he's right. Maybe you can practice and join in next year. Yeah, totally. I was sick of pranking anyway. I just didn't want to bail on you guys. But since you're cool, I think I'll head to the zoo. Oh. You can't hide forever, Link! You come out first! Hey, somebody do something! I thought this was a prank war, not a prank snore! Runny Ann, Runny Ann! Adelaide, no! Ah! <coughs> What's wrong, Adelaide? I need your help, Runny Ann! Sid's in trouble and I can't find my mom! Whoa, slow down. What happened to Sid? The monkeys at the zoo are after her! Oh no! We gotta save her! Come on, Link, let's go! We're under attack! Nico? Uh, I thought we were friends! <laughs> they left! I wonder why. Snake! Snake? Where? Sid, where are you? Right here! But I'm stuck! And I can't see anything! Please tell me Sid's not inside that snake! I was running from the monkeys and I fell into this dark, sticky cave and... Oh, yep, I'm in the snake. Don't worry, Sid, we're coming! <laughs> My only sister! Eaten by a reptile! I'm not emotionally prepared for this! Oh no, you don't! Uh, uh, squeeze, Lincoln! Uh, squeeze! Uh, oh, it's uh, not working! Barf up my uh, sister! Sid! I'm so sorry! We never should have said you were wrecking our prank anniversary. If we just included you, none of this would have happened! It's okay, Ronnie Ann! Because you've just been changed! Sid? Okay, what's going on? At first, I was mad at you guys for not including me. But then, I decided to get even. I had Igor swallow my walkie-talkie, along with a giant turkey. <laughs> Guess he's keeping the turkey. We got you guys good. Wait, so you faked being eaten alive and scarred us for life as a prank? Best prank ever! Really? Aw, thanks, guys. Sorry we underestimated you. We won't make that mistake next prank anniversary. <laughs> Double point! Sid's the winner! Good luck to you guys. Are you sure you're ready? Don't worry about us. We're gonna be A okay. Family, gather round. We can follow the action via the cameras I installed in everyone's room last year... last night! Oh, we have movement in the twins' room. Here it comes! Huh, I thought for sure Luann was gonna nail them with a bucket of grease. Or a sock full of quarters! Old Lincoln is on the move! Slowly. Oh man, I can't watch! What's happening? Did he get injured? Well, he did hurt his back, but it mm -hmm. seems unrelated. What's the deal, you? Why aren't they getting pranked? And why are they leaving the house? <gasps> what the heck? I paid good money for them to get their butts pranked off. Don't look at me. Look at the monitors. I put cameras everywhere so you can enjoy the show. Ta-ta! Ah! It's old Lincoln! What's he doing? Did he get lost? He... <laughs> Mrs. Johnson, it's me, Lincoln! I can't get through another day of school without telling you you are the center of my universe and I love you! Oh no! Uh. Wait! 
Wait! That's my pageant studio! Hi, Lindsay! I know I won Miss Junior Royal Woods this year, but the truth is, your neck is straighter, your hair holds curls better than mine, and your baton twirling puts mine to shame. So here, this really belongs to you. <gasps> oh, sweet irony! We handed Luann the perfect weapons to destroy us! Oh no! My salon! I love my new perm! I can't wait to show all my friends! Ah! Dude, stop! I think I want to take this thing in a new direction. Bogus! That's not even good, Polka! Oh! Ew, ew, ew! A worm! I wouldn't run from it! I'd eat it! Uh, why is my double playing against that dweeb? It's not gonna be much of a competition. No! My 300 game winning streak! What is she doing at my publishers? I know I said I needed another month to work on my novel, but I decided it's actually ready. No! The ending is wrong! I wanted it all to be a dream! Colleagues, I believe that my latest presentation will knock your proverbial socks off. <gasps> this is a kitty. He says meow. The eyes are the windows to the soul, and it's time I bear mine to you. Gasp, those were never meant to be seen. Bangers and Mosh, the British eatery and rock venue? Oh, what's he doing there? Welcome to the Are You a True Englishman trivia challenge. First question, in what city is the Tower of London? Oh, I got this one. Rome. <gasps> Thanks for coming all the way here to meet me, Boo Boo Bear. I just really missed you. Oh, that was my shoe. That was my other shoe. I have some extra shoes in my bag. Uh, Mom, what's going on? Obviously, we're moving, honey. You should go pack your things. What? Why? Well, it's not like we can stay. You pretty much ruined our lives here. Okay, guys, nice try. You almost had me there for a moment. Is this the La Oud's residence? You guys, wait! I'm sorry for the pranking. Please, we can't move! It's too late to turn back now. Uh, no, it isn't. I'll call everyone I embarrassed you guys in front of. I'll explain everything. It's not going to make any difference. So, we'll see you in the Florida Panhandle Tuesday morning. No! We can't leave. Royal Woods is our home. I'm so sorry. I'll never prank you again. April Fools! I really got to hand it to you guys. You're really starting to get the hang of this. But you might want to stop that truck. Actually, most of those boxes were empty, except for the ones filled with your stuff. So you might want to stop that truck. No! Come back! Sergio and his friends should be here any minute. Same with Sparkle Tooth. Hey, Padma, the new electrician dimmed the sign. It looks great. Oh, good. Uh, excuse me. It did we just hear you say that you dimmed your sign? Oh, hi, girls. Yes, sorry it took us so long. We've just been really busy. And Pierre thought he could fix everything himself. Hey, I'm handy. Oh. He made everything worse. But I finally hired a pro. All finished. All la chiquitas. I dimmed the burger sign and put in some fans for the smell so you can stop complaining. I also added vinegar to their ketchup. It needed it. She is a lifesaver. Anyway, we also took Tommy out of the tip song rotation. That guy does not have an inside voice. Order for me now. Wow, you must be hungry. Wow, thank you so much. Could you excuse us for a second? <gasps> oh, no, Sid. They were taking care of everything all along. I know. They're lovely. More about to rain pigeon fury on them. We have to call it off. Sergio, come in. Abort the mission. I repeat, abort the mission. Sergio, come <gasps> Abort the mission. Repeat, abort the mission. I don't copy. Coming in hot. Sergio, did you get that? <gasps> Hello, I'm Jim Sparkletooth. We're at the popular new restaurant, Burger Blast, where I've uncovered another dirty secret. Their burgers are made from pigeon meat. Tell us, why are you using pigeon meat, and how do you sleep at night? What? How dare you? We don't use pigeon. 
Jim Sparkletooth, and I'll be coming for your dirty secret next. Jay Spark out. Get that! that! This doesn't make any sense. Where are these pigeons coming from? As soon as this airs, we're ruined. Not if we can help it. See, come on. I've got an idea. Mr. Snaggletooth, we're the ones who called about the pigeon meat. What? Uh, oh, I see what this is about. You want your $25 for the story tip. Okay. Start the car. It's not about the money. We just don't want you to air the story. Fat chance. This is going to get me promoted. Well, what if I told you we have a better story? Even juicier. Juicier than pigeon meat? I'm listening. Oh, it's on. And now, deception. Debauchery. I'm Jim Sparkletooth, and I've uncovered a hard-hitting story of burgers, sabotage, and pigeon meat. Just how far would two vengeful tweens go to get some sleep? Hey! Vengeful tweens? This eyewitness saw it all. They forced me to bring pigeons and pretend they were in the hamburgers. They're monsters! You're gonna change my voice, right? Monsters, you can say that again. Hey! Oh, okay, maybe we deserved that. But the more important thing is that everybody knows the truth. My friend Sid and I made up the pigeon meat rumor. We just needed sleep! But it was all a misunderstanding. We're sorry, Pierre and Padma. You guys are awesome, and we're lucky to have you as neighbors. Don't forget, we make our own ketchup, and our burgers are made from beef. Delicious beef. I'm Jim Sparkletooth, coming for your dirty secret next. <laughs> Stop the camera! Oh, don't look at me! I'm proud of you girls for doing the right thing, eventually. Thanks, Abuela. And who knew their burgers were so delicious? And they even deliver now. Stop this right now! I keep telling you, I'm retired! There's another prankster afoot! <laughs> Your father's right. She's clearly lying. Let's get out of here. Yeah, 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 yeah. No! That's what the prankster wants you to do. I know how they think. What if Luann's telling the truth? Are you kidding me? Think about it. Those pranks didn't seem like her style. What are you talking about? We're all covered in gross goo. Yeah, but Luann hasn't used fresh whipped cream since the twins were in diapers. Usually she uses the spoiled stuff to draw on raccoons. Maybe we should let her help us stop whoever the real prankster is. We'll keep your room untouched as a memorial. Thanks for believing me, Lincoln. Don't make me regret it. So how do we stop the real prankster? I need to examine the pranks that have been going off to see if I can tell whose style they are. So... You have to let me out of here! <clears throat> sorry, I'm still waiting on that juice. <laughs> uh, let you out? Oh, um, I'm sorry, Luann. I don't know if Look, I can... I don't want to scare you, but whoever the real prankster is, they're leading up to a grand finale. It's April Fool's 101! I can't stop that if I'm in here! Stop! Something's not right. What? Where? Look at the couch! What? Charles is just sipping from a juice box. Totally normal. Charles! Huh? Come here a moment. Now! Now. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, I've never seen Charles do that before. That's because it's not Charles, Lincoln! <laughs> it's... <laughs> Wait. Lily is the prankster? Duh. Wow, this is all really impressive, Lily. The whipped cream, the toilet rocket. Luann, focus! Oh, right, sorry. Lily, you've got to call off your grand finale right this minute. No, the what? Oh. <gasps> A dog bone remote? Well played. Luann, focus! Right, right. Lily, please, you have to stop. All right, kids, here we are. <laughs> I just got a text from Luann. Lily is the prankster? What? But Lily's right here. And she's such a little cutie. <laughs> <laughs> What's this? We're locked in! <laughs> oh no! She rigged Benzilla to drive around on an endless loop! Forever. <gasps> That's 
It's really dark. Funny, but dark. Sorry, Lily, but Lincoln and I are here to shut it down. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry! She's getting away! <gasps> she's in the attic! <laughs> wow, she truly is a pranking genius. <laughs> I gotta shut down the console. Lincoln, distract her. Luann, <laughs> hurry! Her little teeth are so sharp! <laughs> Dang it! Should've seen that coming. Luann, hurry! I can't hold her off any longer! <laughs> oh, hey! There's that juice I've been looking for! Luann! Come on! Right, right! Was bad luck. Good thing your abuela didn't see that. Logically speaking, you'd want her to see that. It proves that bad luck can happen anywhere. Wait a minute. Lisa's right. If we can show abuela that bad luck can happen here too, maybe she'll let us go home. Pancakes, pancakes, making pancakes. <sighs> Needs just a pinch of cinnamon. Phase one, code salty. <laughs> Hmm, that's delicious. I'll have to get your recipe. <laughs> Salty pancakes? That's different. Salty? <laughs> Salados. Oh no, saltiness is a sign of bad luck. <laughs> Ooh, more for me then. Phase two, code black. Phase 2.5? Code shrink. Ah! All the clothes have shrunk and turned black. This is a bad sign. Oh, yeah, Abuela. Really bad. Ecole. Do I feel the breeze? Phase three. Code flush. There she goes. <laughs> and there she flows. Frida, this book on the history of water slides is fascinating. It feels like I'm really there. <gasps> Blood! <laughs> You're making it worse. Ay, ay, ay! Hurry, Mama! Waterfall ahead! Hi! Mr. Mama's coming! Salty food, black laundry, floating coffins. <gasps> now I understand. That bad luck can happen anywhere? See, <gasps> anywhere we go, because we are the bad luck. Huh? Wait, what? We must go where we can't hurt anyone. To the woods. Oh, it is I, Ernesto Estrella. Hall for applause. Who? Oh, look, it's the Bobo in person. Mucho gusto, Bobo. The universe tells me my biggest fan may have a bad luck problem. Ugh. <laughs> oh, yes, there's the black cloud. Don't worry, Miss Estrellitas. I'm here to help. Let's cleanse the Casa Grandes. <laughs> you are all now... I feel it! The curse is lifted! <laughs> what can I say? Ernesto is the best! Booyah! 